Hello, this is Master of Reveal 7, the exciting playthrough of Birth by Sleep Final Mix. And I'm doing quite a bit of grinding off screen. Not on levels, although I've gone up a little bit to level 30. But if I um <laughs> but if I um, um didn't turn my zero XP on, then that would be a much higher level. But no, I was mostly just concentrating on my um, battle commands and stuff. <laughs> but yeah, I got deep freeze. Three surrounding enemies, attack frozen foes to deal you more damage than usual. Kyogre, but obviously. Chaos Blade, press triangle at the right time to perform a series of charging attacks that blind or bind some foes. And Geo Impact, perform a leaping strike which causes giant boulders to burst from the earth and deal additional damage. And a nice mind square of good measure. <laughs> I also decided to make uh, my ice slide so that when I slide them um, in the air, I can, I, do enemies to, I can do damage to enemies. <laughs> so that'd be useful. As for finishes, I got Wamu's Judgment because I managed to get Thunderbolt if you use that a certain amount of times. I'm not sure if the same applies for that one day, but I'm not sure yet. Uh, this one there, I've just been trying to get this one up, getting more money for that one and walking more steps for that one. <laughs> and when I do, then I'll finally go to Dark Star. I might just do that one um, off screen or just skip it entirely for till a bit later. <laughs> And um, also a few abilities as well. I got experience chance. Double the experience XP you see when you HP falls below 25%. It didn't seem that useful to be honest. <laughs> I got a few more attack boosts as well. That's because from the double slot. So in having the double slotted um, battle commander. <laughs> That's why I got a few more lucky strikes. <laughs> And I've also been off screen, I mean, collecting all of the stickers which I um, couldn't get before for all the previous worlds. <laughs> but anyway, let's go to our last Disney World. <laughs> Neverland. Combat level 7. <laughs> Obviously, if you have zero XP, remember to unequip it if you want to actually level up Sara. I mean, <laughs> level up Terra. <laughs> Otherwise, only a command to level up, not Terra himself. Back. You must get me treasure! Leave him to me! <sighs> oh yeah, I've already equipped the hyperdrive keyblade. We can find a few new and versed here. <laughs> I think it'll show you some of the powerful moves. <laughs> oh my, back from my deck battle command. Let's have a look, see. What should I look at out first? Deep freeze. Freeze. Yeah. Chaos blade. So long. Whoa. Take that. Nice. 
See your impact. Want some? Watch out. Uh, yeah, be careful in that follow way. They might do that to you. Oof. Be careful, don't underestimate them. Especially those giant, well, gorilla type unversed. <laughs> that Quake attack they do is killer. <laughs> if I desired your assistance, I'd have demanded it. We had the situation under control. Isn't that right, Smee? Oh, yes, Captain, completely. We would have cleaved those fiends to the brisket, we would. Why, I'd have given them a little of this and this. And don't think your efforts mean you'll get a share of me treasure, understand? I'm not after your precious box, Captain. I'm looking for a person. A boy, wearing a mask. Ring any bells? No, not a one. Figures. It's me, you blithering barnacle. We're off. We shall leave this place before the light draws them back again. Huh? Hey, hold on. What did you just say about the light? Ah, yes, it's heartbreaking, really. This chest, you see, contains light gathered from all around. And I've got an acquaintance, a boy, who's sure to try and seize it. A boy who's after the light. If it's not Benitas, then who? Hey, why don't I help you keep the light safe? Maybe you could tell me more about this boy who's troubling you. What's his name? Peter Pan! Yeah. Told you. Recurring theme. <laughs> but welcome to Neverland. <laughs> but yeah, this sounds a bit this different. This chest must be brought to Skull Rock safely. Don't let that Peter Pan anywhere near it. Right. I got you covered. Because usually in the other versions of Peter Pan, we usually visited the ship or in 358 has two days, a few islands. This time actually there is a Peter Pan sort of home. So it's nice, so it's pretty so it's nice actually. Hmm. Down the crystal. We can never have enough of those. I think this is the map. There we go. Can we go this way? No, we can't. Hmm. Oh, there we go, yeah. If you do that white, you get a Fandago out of it, yeah. <laughs> I don't think you get anything else there out of it. Take that. Any other treasures around here? Nope. Just in there. Take that! Here! 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 
Thank you to the Titan Sonic Bay, it's uh, better. Yeah. <laughs> so the war between the enemies uh, just attacking. Hello, what? Our day that we're in the encampment, so we didn't actually see uh, any, uh, well, of the Indians, <laughs> which is odd. <laughs> nope, nothing there. All right, let's carry on. Don't give these ones an inch. You don't want to give them a chance to retaliate. Take that. Huh? I need to get to score one. Oh, we can't go there. Mm. Annoying. Smart, are they? Here, You can actually swim here. Press circle, you can swim faster. There's also a little nook right here, which can reveal something hidden. Ooh, dark haze. Oh, I made that ages ago. Here, 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 here. Thinking, oh, looks like you can get up there somehow. Must be a way around. Hmm. Can we go back this way? Yes, we can. Nothing. 
Yoink! Ooh, make elixir. Not bad. I can reach that. Hey, got it. Freeze. Oh yeah, I timed that perfectly. Zubadiga, nice. At this point, I've made so many commands now that I'm not really worried about uh, making new ones. The only reason why we make other commands now is to just um, make side abilities and stuff. <laughs> Let's have a look. Any of the next out? Ooh, nice. You know, also, that's Geo Impacts. Uh, huh. Okay, let's have a look. What else to, should I put in there? Hmm. Any other dumb abilities that I got? Oh wait, I had Quake. I remember that. <laughs> yeah, I actually made an air combo plus. But it doesn't matter. I do because I want to Quake. It looks nice. Uh, let's see. Hmm. And there was Zero Gravigo. No, no, no. Why not? And... Ooh, we're yeah, Fundaga. I'll give it a chance to show you a Thunderbolt, actually. There we go. Oh. Yeah, I'm so glad I have those combo pluses. Alright, let's get going. Skip ahead. Nope, nope. Forty four, you guys. Yeah, Mike. Yeah. Whoa. Nice. Oh, dang it. <laughs> Oops, yeah, I've got to be careful. You can't do anything while I'm in the water. You can't even jump. Just got to wait till you get to land. Sorry I don't wish to talk about folks, but at this point you really should be pretty powerful now. You should have made some pretty big ass commands, you know, all that good stuff. Take that. But we are near the end of Terra Story now. Not we still have a little bit to go, but we're not that far now. Oh right, yeah, these boulders, just attack them. Shoot. Just attack him like this. Want some? Take that. Want some? There we go. Earth. Take that. Want some? Take that. I think this, there we go, yeah, this ball is hiding a chest. Firewager, nice. They start giving some really powerful stuff now. Crit. 
ready to impact. Anything down here? No, this is a shortcut. No, I think this is a monster. Yeah, Porto. Mega potion. Eh? Wait, wait a minute. Ah, uh -huh. that's a shortcut. Oh, that's very clever there. It's sneaky, but thunder. Take that. You get Geo Impact? That's nice. Huh. Definitely worth getting to that chest then. Hmm. So definitely get that chest then. So you get Geo, so you get a chance in Geo Impact. Nice. Just skipping now. We've got the chest I need. So I don't mind finding them once, but I've already been to the area. If I'm just backtracking through, just because I was trying to get a certain chest, I'll just skip them. There's nothing there. It's a dead end over there. Ah, here we are. High potions. My game is using those at this point. Cross over to Skull Island? Yes. I mean, Skull Walk. Hmm. Uh, the entrance is through there. But I want to look around. Through chest. Thunder! You need high jump here. Oh, come on, really. Uh, let's see if I can go up from the upper path. I think there's a chest up there, but. There's a cutscene, it probably activates on its own and make me have to get the chest off screen, but let's have a try. Oh no! Oh excellent! Okay, never mind then. What's in here? Mega Elixir. Nice. There seems to be more than one entrance though. Ah oh, yeah, I see it. Oh nice. Ooh, our solemn, sweet, and chaos crystal. There we go. You get our solemn in that chest if you haven't made it yet. Huh. I have though. It's awesome. Ooh. Yeah. 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 Uh. Want some? Take that. Want some? Ooh, very pretty worth it then to get up there. But I think you need an air slide and, and an extra dash just to make it, but it's definitely worth it. <laughs> I used to be curious. 
Yoink! <laughs> yeah, it's a boss fight coming up next. <laughs> Pardon me, Captain, but it's about that shooting star I was mentioning to ye. Mr. Smee, I ordered you to drop that. I'll not have you gushing on about some shooting star. Yeah, but, but, Captain, most shooting stars twinkle for a bit and then they go out. But this one, it, it, it kept on sparkling and shining even after it crashed down. Why, what if it's really a big, enormous, priceless gemstone? Idiot! Why didn't you tell me? <laughs> you still got a one-track mind, Hook. <laughs> hmm? um, we've a bit of business to attend to and must, I fear, step away. I trust you can see to things till I return? Sure. When Peter Payne gets here, I'll be waiting. That old codfish. Looks like he's found himself a new flunky. I'll fly down and distract him. Men, you move in and nab the treasure. Are you Peter Pan? That's me! The light is not yours to take. And here's next fight against Peter Pan. <laughs> not too tough. I don't know if he's even considered a bot, because he don't really take out all of his health. Just watch how he moves. You won't stop me! That we learn blade charge. Another command style. Secondary command style like one breaker. Very nice. What do you want with the light? Light? What light? Look, Pan! We got the chest! No! Not yet, you blockheads! Hey! Woo. Look! <laughs> <laughs> Now what is this? Pirate treasure, of course. Jewels, doubloons, you know, the usual stuff. I've been guarding a pile of loot? Sounds like you've been tricked. I'll say. I owe you an apology. I picked a fight over nothing. Aw, oh, it was all in good fun. Not every day I get to fight such a good swordsman. Say, what's your name anyway? Tara. Right then, Tara. Which way did Hook go? They said something about a shooting star. Shooting star? Tinkerbell must be in danger! Men, guard that treasure with your lives! Aye, aye, sir! You go and get him, Pan! Well, I should be on my way. Without it also falls the dealing with Peter Pan. Well, looks like our work here is done. Once again, meddling in people's business. Good old Terra. Like old friends up to some new tricks. Over there, let's have a look at the new command star we got. Oh, right, yeah, it's in stats. 
Blade Charge. Activate when you're already using commands. Sir. A fire with fire related commands, blizzard related commands, all strike attacks, like fire strike. Yeah, there's a lot of ways you can activate Blade Charge. Hmm. So it's pretty sweet. It's going to be really useful in this fight. Let me check my commands. And it's maxed out. Eh, uh, yeah, fire wagger. Hmm. Well, let's help those kids out. First, stay back. Defeat countless and burst. Oh, I said to get rid of This is why you gotta be careful of right here. Drift! Thunder! Hello, Blade Charge. Nice. Drift. Thunder. <coughs> Damn it, this is where to be careful. Fire. You can easily um Huge chunk of that one. <laughs> yeah, so underestimate them. There's so many that they can easily just bum rush you. <laughs> Boy, you sure cut that monster down to size. <laughs> Shh. Ahoy! How fair ye, lad? Hook! Go hide. Fine. All's well. What's that? Tinkerbell, one of Peter Pan's dearest friends. Can I take a look? So long as I have his precious pixie, Pan's demise is all but assured. <laughs> <laughs> What's the meaning of this? You know, I didn't give it that much thought. Just doing what my heart tells me. That's mutiny! And you'll walk the plank for it! <gasps> that sound! <laughs> Hooray! We sure show hook this time! Every star up there is another world. Huh? Uh. Terra. Yep. Hard to believe there are so many worlds out there besides our own. The light is their hearts. And it's shining down on us like a million lanterns. 
What? I don't get it. In other words, they're just like you, then. What does that mean? You'll find out someday, I'm sure. I want to know now. for the pirate treasures. Hmm. Did you guys really want the jewels and gold that badly? Hmm? Nah, we don't care about that stuff. Uh, but a uh, pan was counting on us. I'll tell you what. Put the stuff that's really special to you in there. That can be your treasure. Yeah! yeah! Real swell idea. Thanks! <gasps> Kind of makes me wonder what I'd put in there. With that, you get the Pixie Pedal, a keeper that makes up for its poor reach with an extra boost in magic. It also makes it easier to land critical hits and deals higher damage when you do. Well, here we go. Somewhere out there, there's this tree with star-shaped fruit. we'll ever be a team again. Looks like all the things that once held us together just push us further away. And now the light has led me here. What am I supposed to do? Was I guided here in order to meet that boy? Oh! Ahoy! We're over here! Riku, race ya! First one to the boat gets to be captain! <laughs> Come on! You call that running? Outside world? Huh? Why would you say that? Because nobody lives out here. And I know you're not from the main island. Smart kid. So how about you? What are you doing here? Oh. My friend's dad took us out on the boat. This is where we like to play. But 
They won't let us grow out here by ourselves. Not till we get older. Must be hard, huh? Stuck in one place. I heard once there was a kid who left for good. So how did you get here anyway? Is there some reason you're interested in the outside world? Yeah. I want to be strong one day. Like that kid who left. He went to the outside world. I bet he's really strong now. I know it's out there somewhere. The strength that I need. Strength for what? To protect the things that matter. You know, like my friends. Outside this tiny world is a much bigger one. In your hand, take this key. So long as you have the makings, then through this simple act of taking, its wielder you shall one day be, and you will find me, friend. No ocean will contain you then. No more borders around or below or above, so long as you champion the ones you love. You gotta keep this a secret, okay? Otherwise, all the magic will wear off. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what was that all about? Uh, you know. <laughs> know what? Why won't you tell me? Who was that guy? Somebody you know? Maybe. Oh, there you go again. Just tell me. I really can't. I've gotta keep it a secret. Not with me, you don't. I'm like the best secret keeper in the world. Nice try. <laughs> oh, Riku! Protect the things that matter. Right. My friends matter to me, too. So, I still have things that I have to protect. And with that, you attend Ends of the Earth, a well balanced key that provides an extra boost in all your stats. Which makes the key base you got from Neverland pointless. <laughs> that light. Is it Ben? Master Terra. Find me. We must speak at once. Master Xehanort. Trusting power. But yeah, that could. But yeah, you don't actually get to visit Destiny Islands. That's just a scene. And not the command board for Neverland. Huh. Yes. And here's the part which I really need to talk to you about. That's Destiny Islands right there. Yeah, it's, it's glowing there because that was just a cutscene. Here's one part you really need to know. Now, if you haven't collected all the chests from, uh, where is it? Where's Land of Departure? From Land of Departure, you want to do that now. Do it now. I cannot stress this enough. You did it earlier, like you got it over with good, but I told you to do it ages ago, which you should have, when I said get it done over. There's a point in the game where you won't ever be able to return to this place anymore. I'm actually drawing close to that now. Let's have a look at that keyblade we got. Actually, let's look at them, both of them. Uh, let's see. Oh, whoops. Encrypt. We got Pixel Petal. It increases magic wire. That's nice. But the ends of the earth is the best one. Yeah. 
very nice. It evens stuff out quite nicely. A well balanced keyblade that provides an extra boost in all your stats. I already said that. <laughs> I might repeat myself. Yeah, pretty much like a powered up version of that one, to be honest. You can tell. But I'm definitely gripping that one instead. Yeah, sorry, Pixel Battle, but yeah, this one's much better. <laughs> but you always get. But um, yeah, that place is just mostly just all cutscenes. You don't get to visit it or anything. Which would be a shame, it would be nice if we got to do, if we got to um, look around there. Hmm. But, eh, I guess those are the breaks. But, hmm, I wonder what Xehanort wanted with Terra. Well, <laughs> we'll find out next time. But with that, this is Mass Room 347, Games of All Titan RPG the platformer. Stay classy.